Hello everyone, this is Zena and here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Mission Dungeon, Dungeon Risk Team DX. Good morning, Zeno. As always, let's do our best. Okay. <laughs> Late riser. Whoa! Gengar! Again? It's the murky cave next. I'll need your help for that. Okay. <laughs> then we'll go to the murky cave. God of War's physical form. That's where it is. For my sake, God of War. Nah, it's, that's not important. I just feel like going. <laughs> okay, go ahead from me to the murky cave. And yeah, same thing. So let's go. The last unlockable dungeon. The murky cave. 19 floors. Murky Cave. We're here. Murky Cave. Don't leave me behind. <laughs> Murky Cave. Oh boy. In the original, this is where all the problems began. Because he only had normal type moves. All because of a coding error. I'm quite sure. This is why you double check your code, folks. Beginning, what I do find the bad is when we get to the later floors when certain Pokemon appear. Well, I want to try and last as long as we can without getting as much items. This place can be quite brutal. Not like Fury Forest levels, but. Okay, I don't know why I chose to use war pulse, but alright. I really hate everything Pokemon which you evolve. And you originally were trash.
Start getting into the tougher Pokemon. Type explosions are appearing. But these aren't the things that I'm afraid of. Oh no, let's see if we can actually. Let's see. Oh. We'll recruit one then. Apparently. Clearly the Pokemon I'm fearing, Magikarp. Ooh, watch out for that very deadly fish. I don't know why I said fish like that. Fish. Is it not actually is it after four nine then? Oh polygon is starting to appear. Here I was thinking this was going to be really 
point because I knew there was some more in there before the dungeon, so I was like, oh, this won't be too bad. Yeah, it could be better. Right, it's because Gengar technically is low for a Disney.
this bank, which is pretty powerful. Sorry I've been quiet because this is just like, I've been just shaking my head being like, Come on. Stone goes in there. Gengar plays the nine tail crest in the hollow spot. <laughs> What's this about? Nothing happened. Huh? I thought I heard something. Kicker, did you just say something? That's odd. Could have sworn I heard something. Well, cut. Well, uh, ilk. Oh. Welcome to Murky Cave. What? What? Where is that voice coming from? Who are you? I am the judge of darkness. You have nothing to fear from me. I mean you no harm. Just now, a key was inserted to break a curse. The curse. It is the one on God of all. Kick it! Exactly! Please, lift the curse now. I cannot allow that right away. I must first know if you have earned the right. I must evaluate you. You must bear your true feelings to me. What? You're going to test me? What, I have to fight some boss creature? <laughs> oh no, nothing so barbaric. All that I need is for is for some answers to be questions to be answered. However. Gengar, you will not be doing the answering. Zeno. Zeno, you will answer. What are you saying? Why is someone else speaking for me? Let me do it. Gengar, your heart is interwoven with conflicting emotions. You will probably never show your... The truth within your heart. What? Zeno will enter Gengar's heart. Please navigate carefully through Gengar's emotions. If you fail to draw Gengar's true feelings, 
curse will never be broken. <laughs> hey, Zeno, don't you dare fool around. I'll make you pay for it. You have but one chance. Zeno, do your best. Fine. It is time. First of all, why does Gengar wish to break this curse? Is to help Gardevoir. That's a lie, isn't it? Didn't Gengar abandon Gardevoir long ago? Why would Gengar want to save Gardevoir now? He came to understand Gardevoir. He came to understand Gardevoir's feelings. What is it you claim to understand? What do you claim to be Gardevoir's feelings? Caring for Gengar. Caring for Gengar. Gardevoir became a presence without a physical form because she bore the curse. But even then, Gardevoir never stopped caring for Gengar. Having learned this, Gengar now wants to save Gardevoir. It makes sense. However, until now, Gengar had forgotten entirely about Gardevoir, correct? Now Gengar wants to save Gardevoir? Isn't that asking a lot? It is. I see. You say it's because Gengar is willing to face the consequences. Gengar is coming to the aid of Gardevoir because he wants help. Is that what you claim? I understand now. My questions are... Gengar, whether you have the right to break the curse or not, I will now render my judgment. The curse could not be. Wait! This is most regrettable, but the curse on Gardevoir will last all eternity. Wait! Wait a minute! Let me... Let me say something. It's true. I abandoned Gard Gardevoir and ran. I was afraid that the curse would fall on me. I had to get away. No matter what. That's what I thought. It didn't take long for me to forget about the curse and about Gardevoir. Many long years have passed. Gardevoir, she never forgot about me. One night, in Zeno's dream, Gardevoir said this. She said that she considered me an irreplaceable friend. But she still believed we would meet again. Gardevoir kept me about someone with me. But I... How selfish I was. I lived carefree all this time. Now, how selfish I was. It's not just Gardevoir. Zeno put up with my selfishness and brought me here. I finally know what I was missing. What I lacked. It's something for others. A sense of gratitude. <laughs> the luck bearing the curses of the asshole. It works, Gengar. Nine tails. But I don't know what you're saying. The curse has been broken. The cosmic curse raised your twist to heart. When your heart gained what had been missing, the curse will shatter. The final key to break the curse. What's your sense of gratitude? Thank God of love. You may be reassured. God of has returned. She will soon be. The fact that you were partnered for part of the past, Garvor will have no recollection of you. That doesn't matter. Garvor is back, and that's enough for me. I wish it didn't keep saying, oh yeah, I can be in, in this camp. Like, yeah, obviously. Thank you so much. My curse is most You did this for me even though I had never met you before. I have no idea how to thank you. From the bottom of my heart. 
thank you so very much for saving me. Good for you, Godfora. Hey, Zeno. Ivory. Thanks for getting me from this. This is my thanks. We got a mobile scarf. Adios. Wait, please. What is it now? Your name. Please, what is your name? Okay. The name's Gengar. Glad to meet you. My name's Gardevoir. I am also glad to meet you. And we saved Gardevoir. Find out what Gengar- Found out completely. 100%. Gengar was that human. How much time was wasted up? I'll probably leave the fee thing later. But I've done a lot of thinking. I would like to join Team Street and help him rescue us. Please, may I become a member? Thank you. I promise to do my best for the team. Gardevoir joins us. Lonely courage. In the original, she was all five. And shows how experienced she probably would be at this point. Next time. Well, I'll show off what being thieves like. And, well, we'll see what happens. Now, probably the last time we've seen as we go on to Team Nostalgia, Ja, my personal team, in the next episode as well. This is Zeno and Zimmer, signing out.